Hello, I'm Nishdar. And I'm Hello, I'm Brian Chang. Hi, my name is Momo Saku. And I'm running to be your 22,000 senior class VP. I'm class president because as a freshman, I came into Irvington. I wasn't really happy with the school. I didn't know anyone here. But over time, I grew to love the school. And this love has grown into a passion. And I want to convert this passion into making a senior year so memorable that we'll never forget it. Um, I kind of used to be in the background when I started off as a freshman, and I so many doors have opened out opened up for me throughout the years and I want to extend that opportunity towards everyone else. One of my favorite quotes about leadership is anyone who inspires others to do better is a leader and I feel like I have the capability to, um, to encourage everyone in our class to do their best whether it's in schoolwork or sports or academics or just for our class as a whole I think that I can implement my passion for this class into everyone. Because I want to make our class have a such a memorable year for their senior year, because senior year is where it's at, you know, it's it's really where we become like adults really. And it's like the end of our childhood, you know? So my goal as being senior class vice president is to like the most amazing senior year so that we can remember it for years for years to come by. I want us to look back from memory lane and think, wow, senior year was a great year. Our spirit day should be an unforgettable day of our lives. Senior year is the last year, the last year we get to spend being children before we part ways for college. And this is why it is so special. Some of my ideas for this class would be to create a spirit commissioner. Um, one, we'll have one or two people on class council who are in charge of bench building and spirit week. So that way it's not just the president and the VP, we'll have more people on class council who are in charge of bench building and during the whole summer. So it won't be like someone who's not free or they have vacation. So they'll just be home the entire time and will be in charge. I think that will be that will be really um, efficient for bench building. Has such a amazing spirit week that it'll it would inspire the next upcoming classes to really like try to beat us and bring spirit week to the stream meeting. Yeah. Building unity is not just about fundraising and bench building. It's about being together and supporting one another as a class. And I feel like I've seen so much negative energy and bullying throughout my three or four years of high school and I think that as VP I want to make sure our class feels like one of a family and that they can go to anyone in our class for help. And that's why I want you to vote for me so that we can make senior year a blast. Um, I would say I would be the best candidate because I am an ASB this year and even though it's only one year I've really learned a lot about the school. I've really learned like what the structure is and I've, we plan a lot of dances, we plan many events so I really think that I can use those experiences in being vice president. I think the thing that separates me from the other candidates is my enthusiasm. I think this enthusiasm is very outgoing and very special to me because it gives me the motivation to do the best job I possibly can. Um, I've been an officer for seven different clubs this year, including one that I started myself. So I know the way people interact with each other and the relationships that people build. And I know how to take advantage of those relationships and put them to use in like Spirit Week and to for a whole class. With this enthusiasm, I'll be able to meet all my officer duties by the deadlines and exceed the expectations. And this is why my enthusiasm is so powerful and this is what makes me the best candidate. I've always like been spirited throughout the three years I've been here so far. Um, I've done the class dance. Um, I've gone to as many bench buildings as I could and I've gone to the last two all-nighters. Lynch. I really think that we could do a lot with our class. We have a lot of potential. Our class is amazing. We have, we're so spirited and it's just it's awesome. Will we ever learn to speak dolphin? This is a ridiculous question. I spoke dolphin all through my childhood. If you guys want to learn how to speak dolphin, I can find someone online or I can organize a class field trip where we all go to SeaWorld and we can learn from the dolphin if you guys want. <laughs> I think the real question is, will dolphins ever be able to learn human? Because, I mean, what if you're like drowning in the ocean and then like a dolphin comes up and he's like, hey man, what's up, you wanna ride? And you're just like, dude, yeah! And then you just go off and stuff that and you live happily ever after. This has come to an issue. I, I didn't know other people couldn't speak dolphin. Alright, scratch everything. New plan for next year. We're gonna change advisory to dolphin tutorial class. Okay, we're gonna bring in dolphins from SeaWorld and everywhere they can find and we're gonna learn dolphin. This is gonna be our goal. 
and no child will be left behind.